Hi, I'm Angelica Rogers. You can call me Jill. I am the ghost tour guide and, and historical tour guide for Victoria's Black Swan Inn. Angelica. See, it, it drives me nuts when people say your name incorrectly, but I, I've always, Jill, I have always said your name right. I did, I did not know her name was spelled Angelica. <laughs> Pronounced that way. Angelica. Angelica. A N G E L K A. Yes, although I forget it on a regular basis, but once in a while I get her email and then it confirms again that I've been saying it wrong each time. What really piss pisses me off, what I really, really get irked about is when people call me Angelica. I thought it was always Angelica, like the rugrat. Jell is freaking awesome. I mean, that lady, she knows her stuff. I mean, she's been doing this like. She was ghost hunting in the womb, like not even kidding. She had her own like flashlight and EVP monitor. And I mean, seriously, it's gone on that long. Yes, I have seen a ghost. I've seen um, balls of energy, balls of uh, ultraviolet energy. I've seen uh, many shadow people, but not yet a full bodied apparition. I, I think that's kind of awesome that I really see that she has a sixth set. That's kind of scary to be around sometimes. That... She would hear something or get a little you know, just something in her head told her something was in the room and just the way she reacts, it makes you kind of react and you're just like, ooh, I don't know if I want to be around this girl. And she's got so many toys, like, okay, you know how some women will have like the pure romance parties and they'll sell toys, right? I, I swear to you that Jell like is in some secret society where they sell ghost hunting toys and have a little party, a little Tupperware party and they sell ghost hunting toys. I think she does that, I really do. Oh my God, Russell, I don't even want to think about how much money I've spent on ghost hunting equipment. I, will, I would love to go, go ghost hunting with her on her first day. That'd be, that'd be cool, that'd be an ideal date for her and me. <laughs> I'm not afraid, I'm not afraid to take a stand, take a stand.